What's up, Beowulf? How's it going, buddy? How's it going, buddy? Did you get a shower? Did you get a shower, Beowulf? Have you been freaking out, huh? Is your is your wife going through a, a little heat there? Huh? Huh, Beowulf? Is she going through some some stuff right now? And you just wanna get down to business, don't you, buddy? Don't you, buddy? Yeah, you do. You just can't take your eyes off the door. You're just waiting for it to open. Freaking out, man. I wish you didn't piss everywhere. Dang it. Hey, Beowulf. What's up, buddy? 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 Oh, you just fall. No, slip. <laughs> Forgot you had those paws. Then you get you some water shoes. You can slide around on the, the cement. Ain't that right, big whoa? Big whoa, 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 whoa? Come here, Beowulf. Come here, buddy. Yeah, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. You're just going crazy right now. Every single time that I see him, and he's, uh, you know, I'm not sure if you guys know this, but when a dog, you know, the female goes into heat, the male dog will start, like, just lapping up the, the urine. And uh, every single time... She goes out and she has to piss. He just wants to go race out there and just so he can just like devour the urine. You know, that, that, uh, this is going to be kind of gross, but even the, you know, her, her, when she bleeds, you know, he's going and licking that up too. He just loves it. And he's like, his eyes just kind of glaze over. He, uh, he'll start to, um, his mouth, he'll do this weird thing. It's like, he goes like this, he's like, <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, um, it's really weird, man. If you've never seen it before and been exposed to it, I can understand why you'd be like, what the frick? Some of my neighbors uh, were freaking out one time because this happened last uh, summer too. And they were like howling and howling and screaming. And they thought something was wrong. Like people came over to my house and was like, is everything okay? I'm like, yeah, it's just, uh, you know, I don't know how to get dogs. And they just freak out, man. There's nothing you can do about it. There's nothing you can do about it. Besides maybe uh, just uh, <laughs> try to hope the neighbors don't call the cops on you. Because the neighbors did call the cops on me. Some other neighbor. I don't know which neighbor called the cops on me. But called the cops on me. It was during the summertime and they were freaking out, breaking down the fences and stuff like that, man. It was just like hectic. That's one thing that's kind of bad about huskies. Um, for me, anyway, these dogs, he's a, he's a hybrid, actually. He's a, well, technically, people don't like that term hybrid because it's not a hybrid. It's like a liger, like a, ti a tiger and a lion. That's a, a real hybrid, right? Because it's kind of like two different species that can actually uh, be mated. But then they're, um, I guess, sterile. They can't reproduce after that so it's only one generation and then they die off but for for him since you know dogs and wolves are technically still the same species um yeah so it's just a a siberian husky is the female um but he's a he's a, a husky wolf dog and he's low content so he still acts a lot like a dog but you know he's got some real strong instincts and everything real good dog always been real loving and but he just he'll run off man that's what i was saying yeah anyway uh that's one thing i don't like about the huskies is they just want to run they want to run forever i mean i have to go and take them to the park and i do this thing called uh urban mushing right so i'll get some of these i got my skates here right so i get the skate right and i got these you know racing wheels right here and with these racing wheels, can easily, uh, you know, fly. I think we get going like probably 20, 25 miles an hour. And we're just, you know, from a cold start, we'll just jump off the line. <laughs> and we go to this little park that's kind of got a paved road. And uh, they'll just go crazy. I actually busted my ankle on those things too. Because uh, so it can be dangerous. You can get going real fast. But uh, anyway, then we use a little harness like this. It's like normally I got like, you know, uh, a little choke collar on him because he's such a big ass dog you gotta you gotta pull on him a little one little while and uh 
But anyway, I can I can take them with this, but that's mostly for you know on uh, normal walks. But this is like when we go mushing and stuff like that. He really likes it. They get to run around a lot. But I'll still go and like I'll still go and like really do some running with them at the park. Like we'll go around my neighborhood and we'll go and run and then we'll walk for a little while and then we'll start sprinting. And I don't mean like jog, I mean like sprint as hard as we can go. And then we kind of stop for a little while and he seems to really like that. So I don't know. This is over here hanging out, chilling. Chilling Bay Wolf, chilling Bay Wolf, chilling Bay Wolf. It's a good boy. Good boy, buddy. He's still freaking out, but he seems to be a little bit more interested in what I'm doing right now. So I'm distracting him in a little bit. That's why I'm kind of doing this video is kind of trying to ease his pain. <laughs> I just felt too bad keeping him inside the cage for so long. He's howling in here. Like, let me out, let me out. But I can't let him inside the house because if I let him inside the house, I'll just start trying to get all up on his woman. And, you know, I kind of feel bad. I want to let him do his thing, but... It's just, uh, I don't want to be dealing with puppies, man. It's, uh, it's a lot of work because they'll wake you up in the middle of the night. You have to feed them all the time. And uh, once they get like only a month old, these guys, his puppies will start wanting kibble. Um, you know, so yeah, other than the, the urban mushing and stuff like that, I tried to get my, my daughter into it and I tried to get my wife into it and they just, uh, weren't really into the whole skating thing, I guess. But anyway. Uh, yeah. Anyway. That's that's all I wanted to talk about. Yeah, this, uh, this guy right here wanted to let him get out of the cage a little bit before, you know. Anyway, maybe I can turn on the lights so you guys can see him a little bit better. Right now he's a little wet because I sprayed him down too. Because, you know, he peed everywhere. As you can see, the floor is wet. It's not usually this color. Yeah, that's that's how he looks. He looks kind of red. He looks kind of red right now, but he looks like more of a golden color when he's not wet. You can kind of see on his face, it's like really light looking. He's a good dog. He just he's just really feeling some kind of like sex drugs. <laughs> he's going off on his hormones right now. But he's about he's about two and a half years now. So he's, uh, he's full grown and, uh, he looks kind of, he looks pretty lean right now. I think he's got, still got the winter coat, so he, he'll get, he'll get a little bit bigger. I'll, I'll bend down a bit so you can see him from, from this angle. Back up, Bill. back up. I'm trying to show the, I'm trying to show the world your astounding physique. Watch out, buddy. Come on, man. Sit down, sit down, sit down, Beowulf. Sit down. Sit down, buddy. Sit. 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 Good boy. Good boy, buddy. Hey, Beowulf. Beowulf. Up. Up. As you can see, I'm going to put, put my hand up to like as tall as I am. And that's how tall he is. Damn near. It's like, he's, he's like, I'm six foot. I'm six foot. So he's like probably five, ten, maybe five, nine. So he's a pretty tall dog. He, I, I took him into the vet and uh, he weighed 105 pounds. So uh, probably not the biggest dog, but you know, he's, he's a pretty big dog. It's a pain in the butt. And if, you, if you're gonna get a dog, you better make sure you really want a dog because they are a lot of work, man. They are a lot of work. If you wanna do anything else, travel plans, you know, anything, it's gonna be going to be a lot of work, but you know, anyway, uh, just wanted to let you guys know this video is getting kind of long, not really talking about anything, just showing a dog walking around me in circles. <laughs> but anyway, all right, you guys have a good one. Later.